What's up, YouTube? It's the Dawn, where shit gets real. Today, as you can see by the intro, I'm going to be talking about more cereal juice. <clears throat> okay, so this time I'm going to talk about the whole line, and I'm going to start rating my juice from 1 to 10, so you guys can get a better understanding of what I like, instead of just saying it's good. Okay, so, without any more yipping and yapping, I'm going to start off with the one that I least like. So let me tell you this. Anything, you know, four under, I really, really did not enjoy at all. So let me start off with the one that I least like out of the bunch is Center Out. Focus. God damn it. Focus. There you go. Center Apple. Center Apple Hoops. Okay, so let me take a tote of this. I got it in this this Delta and this AR mod. Mm, don't like that one at all. Um, it tastes like like a sour apple. You ever, it, it, here's the good thing. It doesn't taste like a fake apple. It tastes like one of those green apples you get um, that's sour. Um, it and mixed with cinnamon, and the two to me just don't go together well. Um, I will say this though. Every let me give you a good example. Here we go. See that? These are the same juice. This bottle is full. This bottle is not. These are the same juices. One is steeped and one is not. Once you get it, they're going to be clear. So give it time to steep. Um, and it turns a color. Here's another one that was clear when I got it. And now it's that color. So these juices do need steeping time. And in order for it to get this color, um, it was about 10 days. So <clears throat> give it time to steep. Um, you will enjoy your vape much better. Now this one is still a little clear, but I'm just not a big cinnamon fan. And this one, mm, I just, I didn't like. So out the bat, I'm going to give this one a five. This one is a five. It may get better, it may not. All right. So I'm not really going to talk about the ones that I already talked about before. And those are Silly Rabbit and Perfect Squares. Um, Silly Rabbit, I will give that one a seven. Um, it's it's a very enjoyable vape. Um, it tastes like Fruit Loops, Fruity Pebbles, um, but to me, the Perfect Circle was better than the Silly Rabbit. With the Perfect Circle, you get a little bit of that orange zest. Um, you get the lime um, and the milk. Let me take a tote of it. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Um, so for Perfect Circle, I will give that one, let me see, an 8. I'll give this one an 8. Between 7.5 and 8. This one is a, a go. It's a go. Um, so here's two that I haven't talked about. And one of them is a cinnamon. Now, I can't stand cinnamon. Can't stand it at all. I mean, when I first started vaping cinnamon, you know, it would kill tanks, it would crack tanks, um, and back then the cinnamons weren't that good. But nowadays, the juice makers, they have gotten cinnamon down packed. And this one, Crazy Squares, they got this one down. I have that one in this hickama chicka. Let me take a toe. It's good. It's really good. Really good. It tastes like a cinnamon cinnabun. You know, really good. You, 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 you can even taste like icing. It tastes like a cinnabun with milk. The shit is delicious. Um, 
And the crazy thing, and what I'm upset about is when I first got it, I knew what it was, didn't taste it, and I had promised it to somebody already. So I'm kind of pissed that I promised it to them, but I'm going to send it to them anyway. Um, I'll just buy me another bottle. That person does a lot for the vegan community as well, so I'm going to send it to him so he can enjoy it. He loves cinnamon. Anyway, let me take another tote of this shit. This shit is delicious. Wow. It's good. I, it's good. Now, this one came about this color. So, I'm not sure if it'll, it'll benefit from steeping. Um... When I send it off, I'll let them decide whether or not they want to steep it some more or not. But that one is a go. I would give that one an eight as well. Okay, milk and burn. Now, out of all of them, I enjoyed this the most. Even though I am a big Fruit Loops fan, this one I enjoyed the most. This one, it's got a little color to it now as well. Um, that one tastes like those corn oats um, and blueberry marshmallows and milk. All three of them. You get all three of them with that one. It is really, really good. I even took it to my local vape shop, the guys at the vape line, and um, my, the regular crew that's there when I go in there weren't there. So it was like a new crew. I didn't know any of them, but I said, hey, what the fuck? Here, try this. Tell me what you think. And all of them that tried it, they all liked it. All of them looked at the RDA like, damn, that was good. It tastes like Blueberries, or blueberry marshmallows with little corn oats and milk. They got that one down. I think I got it in this thing. It's almost nothing in there, but let's see. it's good. All that, all this cereal, um, city vapes are high BG. Um, I will tell you when they send you a bottle, the bottle is to the top. I mean, if these are like 33 mil bottles, they give you 33 mil. I can imagine when they're filling these things and they put the dropper in, juice runs out the side. Because when you get it, it's full to the fucking top, which is a good thing. And another thing I noticed that when I first ordered from them, they sent me bottles like this and like that. They don't have childproof tops on them. Um, and later, the bottle started having childproof tops on it. So kudos for them for putting childproof tops on them. I will say this, even if your bottle has childproof tops on it, guys, you got to keep it from your dogs, your pets, your cat, hamster, whatever, and your kids. Um, keep it away from your kids so they don't, you know, drink it. Because if they smell this stuff, this stuff smells delicious, they will taste it. Um, you don't want them doing that. And we don't need that in this community right now, especially with all these regulations trying to come down. So with that being said, and me rating all these five juices, um, really ain't got too much else to tell you. I will tell you this, though. If you're a first-time buyer from Cereal City Vapes, by the way, their website is hometownvapor.com or hometownvapers.com. They are in Kalamazoo, Michigan. I didn't say this before. I'm going to say it now. The guy who created these juices grew up in a town where they made cereal um so he smelled fruit loops all day he smelled all the different cereals all day long so he tried to replicate those childhood memories and put them in the box in, in these bottles and on four of them he did a good job on the one of them um i think they need to rethink that one i, I just got to keep it real with you guys um matter of fact i think he did say we're going to redo one of them and it might have been the center apple hoops it might have been but the other four are good. You can't go wrong with Milk and Berry, and you can't go wrong with Crazy Squares. Those two are by far very, very, very good. Um, like I was about to say, they have a discount code. If you're a first-time purchaser from their website, they have a 20% off coupon. And if you already purchased from their website, you can use my coupon, which is called The Dawn 10, and you get 10% off. Um, I just ordered some Milk and Berry, and it came to $21.99 with shipping. That was a total cost. So I saved like two bucks. So I encourage you to save all the money you can because this hobby can get expensive. And like I always say, if you can help somebody get off the stinkies, the cigarettes, you know somebody that smokes and they want to get off, give them your old equipment. Tell them, hey, if you don't like it, give it back. I'll give it to somebody else. And nine times out of ten, they will say yes. I know when I was a smoker, I wanted to stop and 
if somebody gave me one of these devices, let me take a toe. If somebody gave me one of these devices, I would have, you know, took them up on their offer. Um, you know, in my profession now, I'm around people, new people. Um, I'm a realtor, so when I'm around people and they smoke, I can tell right off the bat. And I can imagine how I used to smell when I smoked. When you smoke, you stink. This is point blank. When you smoke in your house, your house stinks. Point blank. When you smoke in your car, your car stinks. Just point blank. It's just no way around it. You can put those for breezes in there all you want. The shit stinks. The shit's in your pores. It's in your clothes. It's in. It's in everything. It's in your hair. So, um, most people that smoke, that's been smoking for a while, they want to stop. Um, and hey, give them a hug and say, hey, smell me. Do I stink? You don't have to smell that stinking asses. But anyway, yeah. Try to get somebody off the stinkies. And until the next time, pay it forward.